So today I created this look, cut crease, smoky, neutral eye. If you guys want to know how to get it, continue watching. Okay, let's get started. I always start off with my brows. I will leave this link down in the description box down below. So let's start off with primer. I always prime my lids so that the eyeshadow lasts all day. So I'm just going to apply that all over my lid and just blend that in. Now going in with peaches and cream, I'm going to apply this in my crease, but I'm going to apply it in my crease and then move the brush up towards my eyebrow. So applying in my crease and then up towards my eyebrow. In with Chickadee, I think this is a very beautiful color for my skin complexion. I feel like it just blends everything so well and it's just a really, really pretty transition color. So I'm going to blend that in my crease up towards my eyebrow as well. So crease and then blending up towards my eyebrow. Now going in with Ice Queen, I'm going to apply this underneath my brow bone. And this has a lot of shimmer in it, which I like because it feels like it lifts my brow up a bit. I don't know. I don't know if you guys can tell the difference, but I feel like it just gives it like a little lift underneath my brow. Now going in with this color from the BH Cosmetics palette, I'm going to blend this in my crease as well. So I'm just going to buff that in and just blending it, blending it back and forth, trying to build up that color as much as I can. Now going in with Strange from the Naked 3 palette, I'm just going to apply this all over my lid, building that color up so that it is really, really light. Now going in with this Perfusion palette, I'm going to use this dark, the darkest shade, this dark brown right here. And then with the pencil brush, I'm going to start cutting my crease. So I'm going to build that color in my crease and just make sure it's really, really intense. And then I'm going to go in with a shadow brush and I'm just going to buff that out. Now repeating the same step to my other eye, so going in with that dark brown with the pencil brush, carving out my crease, and then going back in with the eyeshadow again, you know, darkening that color up, and then blending it out with an eyeshadow brush. Now going in with Coco Bear, I'm going to apply this on the eyeshadow brush, and I'm just going to buff that in my crease so I'm just going to blend that color in making it very very intense just buffing it in making sure not to bring it down towards my eyelid so just staying really focused on the crease Now going in with a plum eyeshadow, I'm going to put that in my crease and start blending that color in. So I'm mixing the plum and that dark brown together and I'm just blending that in and I'm also using a blending brush too to blend out any of the harsh lines. So again with this eyeshadow brush, I'm going to use it to cut the crease and make it really, really dramatic. So using that plum eyeshadow and dark brown, just deepening that crease up and making it really sharp and dark and then blending out any harsh lines with a fluffy brush. So right here, I'm just cleaning it up, going really slow, circular motions, making sure that there's no harsh lines and everything looks really nice and blended. Now going in with my NYC eyeliner, I'm gonna eyeliner, I'm gonna apply my eyeliner. So with this look, I paired it with a nude lip, or you can go bold. And this is the Wet n Wild. I will put the lipstick color down below. But yeah, well, which one did you prefer, the bold or the nude? So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up and stay tuned for my next video. Thanks. Bye.